In a world of information overload, a provocative statement is a great conversation starter with executives. The reason it's so powerful is you can use the SPICE framework to leverage something that's publicly available and have the system summarize it so that you can maximize your time based on the research that you've done with the various stakeholders that you've already spoken to. A provocative statement is a key in getting the executive's attention. Let's see how we can do that with ChatGPT. The first step is that we're going to train the system what a provocative statement is. I'm going to copy paste this example on the right that we'll share in an annex to this video. When we go, the other thing that we'll be looking at is the 10K that's publicly filed on Asana's website. Now, before we jump into the actual prompt, it's always important to know to not put in private data into this machine for it to do its summary work. Let's see what it spits out. So this is where we took our standard provocative message framework and just taught GT GPT to understand how we would like it to frame our message. So I'll copy the PDF and I'm using a plugin within ChatGPT so that it can understand what the PDF looks like. This plugin will show you how to install on a separate video. And we're talking on average 150 pages of financial data that it will take us an hour just to read and understand, right? So we're asking ChatGPT just to extract some meaningful insights that we can start a conversation with the executive. Now, once it spits out the summary, it is your job to refine it based on the research that you've done. This is a great start, but it's not something that you should use out of the box. A provocative statement is best used during a live conversation and use this tool to get close, but refine it based on your expertise and what you know about your client.